Hey, Gold Digger, Kimberly Olson here back for another episode of Hashtag Get Lit, where we crush your business in less than 10 minutes. For today's episode, I'm going to teach you how to bulk create content for Canva, right inside Canva, using AI. It's been all the rage lately. I'm going to show you how we're specifically going to utilize the tool called Chat GPT. So if you are sick and tired of spending so much time creating content, this training is for you. Stay tuned. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into Canva and we're actually going to come up and find a template that we want, we want to start with. So that way, when we create the bulk content, we have the look that we're, we want the consistency with the with the different posts. So I just typed in Instagram post picture quotes. I really like the ones that have you know a picture of me in the background kind of faded out. You could also take out the word picture and just put Instagram post quotes. Or maybe you want to generate tips for your audience. So it could be uh, Instagram post uh, sharing tips and it'll it'll set it up where it's structured that way. So just do a search here for that. And this is what came up. So let's say we're going to pick this one right here. And and there's other similar ones down here. But let's just say I'm going to do something with a picture of me in the background. It's not this template. So the first thing you want to realize is that when we bulk create, we're basically going to use this for each canvas, right? Canva. So if I want a different background of me, I can just put a picture in here. Let's see if the, there's an easy one here. I'll just grab this one and see if it'll work. Okay. So let's just say this is what I'm going to use for the back. Okay. Now what I want to do is we're actually um, we're going to move this down here and maybe all of them are going to say the gold digger girl. So basically play with this first one to get it how you want it. Okay. And colors, fonts, you know, whatever you want to change on it, but we're going to come up with motivational quotes and and fill in this spot here. Okay. I think I probably want it smaller because I have a feeling these quotes are going to be bigger than that. And then I'm going to take this out right here. I'm going to move this up a little bit. So basically, we're going to use this as our flow. Okay. So play with this until you have it how you want it. You can adjust it afterwards as well. Because obviously, you can't see the font here. So I might you know, change it to a dark gray, which is the right color for me. Okay. You could change the color, whatever you want to do. So now you're going to go to chat GPT. So just type in chat GPT and it'll come up. So I already typed in um, female entrepreneur, uh, motivational quotes for female entrepreneurs and came up with this. Um, I'm going to do it again to show you how it works. So right when you come to here, there's a section here in the bottom. You're just going to tell this AI what you want it to do. So create motivational quotes by women. I want quotes that are written by women that are motivational. That's what I'm looking for. You could put... um, generate, you know, um, come up with five tips for, for building your business on social media, or what are, uh, three plant-based foods that are going to make you live longer. Like you literally can ask it anything that you want. Okay. So you just hit the generate button and it is generating for me. And then you can tell it to stop. So we're just going to do, we'll just do five of them. So we'll stop there with the five. So you just copy the ones that you want. It's going to grab the bullet here of the five. Um, So you might have to edit that out. I'll show you what that looks like real quick. But I'm going to go over to Google Sheets or Excel, whichever one that you want to use. Okay, hang on one second. Okay, so we're in Excel. So you just go ahead and copy and paste those five quotes that we came up with. So I'm going to take out the... The one in there, if you want to take the quotes out, you can take the quotations out because you already have quotes in the graphic. You can do this in the document or right here before we do this. Okay. So you're just going to get this all listed out in Excel. You're going to hit file, save as, and if you've not used this before, we're actually going to save this as what's called um, XML1. We're going to save it as a CSV file. So when you hit the drop down, that should be one of the choices. If you're in Google Sheets, you just click file. 
download and then it'll say CSV. It's a certain format that's used for this kind of thing. Just say yes. So we have that saved. Now we're gonna go back to Canva to finish this out. So come back to Canva to your canvas and then come over here to apps and you're gonna click bulk create or you can search bulk create if it doesn't come up for you. But you can actually, what I just did where I put the data in that Google Sheets, you can enter it manually. So if you already know what you wanna do for all of these, you just hit enter data manually and you can type them. I'm gonna upload the CSV file because I'm all about efficiency. <laughs> So there's my demo. Um, so we'll go ahead and click on that. And the last step is where do we want them to put this information? So just click right on the text where you want it. Click this and you're going to click connect data. Okay. Click that first one. So it knows this is what I want. And there, there's your quote. Right? And um, normally it doesn't have those little bars there. So I'm not sure why you might have to play with that because I will use our error there. And then you're going to click continue down here and say, I want it to do for all of them. Okay, so we're gonna uncheck these because I had already used the sheet for something else. I think it's pulling old data, so yours won't do that. So we've got those, generate four pages. It's gonna reopen a new Canva with all of them in there. As you can see, I've got page one, two, three, four, and then the five is the one that we just had open. So you can go in and move them around, edit them, but look at how quick that was. I mean, you could literally go into chat GPT and just say, give me 100 motiv motivational quotes for, for female entrepreneurs. And you can even just a note here, you can, you can tell it, um, you know, I'm looking for edgy quotes or I'm looking for, you know, sassy quotes. Like you can literally tell it, you know, for, just be as detailed as possible possible, and it's going to give you a different uh, generation from that, okay? So that is how you actually um, are able to bulk create. Isn't that cool? So I hope this was helpful. If it was, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you never miss a video or the like, one, like button if you're following this on, on Facebook. And if this was helpful, take a screenshot because we want to make sure others know about this amazing goodness when it comes to Canva and bulk creating and AI and all the things. And there's so many different things you can use it for. I'm going to do more videos on that as well. So take a screenshot and tag me at the Gold Digger Girl. I'd love to give you a shout out for doing that. So appreciate you. Until next time, get lit in your business and set your soul on fire. We'll see you soon. Bye.